Scientists today showed off the first picture of a black hole. Albert Einstein's theories predicted the existence of these mysterious bodies. Now we have seen one. Here's Mark Strassman. With this image, science fiction became fact. It's the first visual proof black holes exist, like this donut-shaped behemoth rotating 55 million light years away. So you're basically looking at a supermassive black hole that's almost the size of our entire solar system. Yay! Black hole hunters are ecstatic. The cosmos just gifted them their holy grail. Black holes are pure gravity, the universe's ultimate irresistible force. Beyond the hole's boundary, the point of no return. Time ends. All matter and light disappear. It's a one-way ticket to oblivion. To know that these monsters exist, that is humbling. Astrophysicist Shep Dolman directed 200 scientists to build the Event Horizon Telescope. Through ingenuity and working as part of a team, we were able to bring it to life. They coordinated eight radio telescopes in high, dry places around the world. That network created an Earth-sized virtual telescope looking to bring the invisible into focus. Their massive data dump took two years to process. It's awe-inspiring, the colors, the image, the moment. It, absolutely. It's, uh, it, it's breathtaking. Um, and when we saw this come into focus, Whoa. Uh, our jaws dropped. This hole is a monster. Its mass weighs six and a half billion times that of our sun. The challenge of imaging an object so far from Earth was compared to someone in Washington, D.C., reading the date on a quarter in Los Angeles, an image that's instantly iconic. Uh, the, the Earth rise over the moon, uh, the first X-ray, seeing the inside of a hand. You know, these are the kind of things that make you realize that there is a world that's been inaccessible to us that we can now see. There's also a black hole in the center of the Milky Way, 26,000 light years from Earth. This same team has been imaging that one. When will we get to see it, Jeff? All they'll say is, stay tuned. An amazing story and just amazing science, Mark. Thank you very much.